right, so sorry that this is going to be hard to see, but <clears throat> across the field there, that is a 737 Model 200. Um, they come in, it's picking up firefighters, and it's going to be going uh, off to fight. They're going to fight fire storm. I don't know. <clears throat> well, anyways, there's a chance that we were going to fuel them, and uh, they decided that they didn't. I don't know. I well, presume they decided they didn't want fuel because they can't have the uh, plane loaded up and then fuel, I guess. I don't know. Well, they've loaded the plane, so we're presuming they're going to need fuel, which is good but bad. It's bad because it's a fuel something we missed, but it's good because we got a surprise this morning, too. Uh, four F-18s come in this morning, too. So... Like you say, you know, it's good. You know, all the, you know, it'd be nice if you could go pump the fuel into them and sell some fuel. We just don't physically have the capacity we need to fuel them. So, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe they might still call. We're not just 100% sure yet. So, anyways, I'm over here fueling this F-18 right now. There's two more over there and one more back behind it. Now, what's really funny about this actually is I recognize these. I know, but no. The reason why I say I recognize these is because in one of my first videos, I'll put the link right down here, right? We fuel, we had four F-18s come in. And the numbers that are up on the nose there, 304 and that one was 305, they've been in here before. I recognize those numbers. And I recognize the thing on the tail. I recognize all of it. So they've been in here before. But yeah, so anyways, we got four F-18s in here. I'm gonna show you something I like about the four F-18s. Um, the first thing is when you say you look at the landing gear, they have massive landing gear. Now there's a reason for this because they don't land, they crash these into the uh, carrier deck. So they have to have the really big landing gear to support that impact that they do. <coughs> um, but yeah. So anyways, to show you how you fuel them, the fueling port's up here on the nose. Right? You plug in here. Here's the ground. Flip this switch up right there. Now what that does is it fuels these drop drop tanks first. So you fuel the drop tanks first. It'll now the pre-check, which do pre-check is make sure it's gonna shut off. Little thing right there. You turn it this way, push it, turn it, and it pops out, it'll shut off. Turn it, put it back in, and it shuts, turns off, or whatever, you know. So then once it's topped off, it'll stop, you flip that switch down and it fills the rest of the plane. Now these ones, you notice the intake, so the small little round ones towards the back. This is just a Hornet, a Super Hornet's going to have a larger square intake that's going to be considerably farther, and it's just going to be like an angled off square instead of that little round one. But so, <clears throat> yeah, anyways, fueling these, they were here before I got there, so they've already fueled most of them, I'm just helping. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so anyways, just gonna finish fueling them. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know what to say. Yeah, it's really cool. You see all these cool jets and that on a regular basis. Um, okay, yeah. So way back over there, they closed the door to the the 737. So that means it's gonna take off. And I will show you the takeoff because it's going to be taking off right over here. I'll show most of it anyways. So, anyways, guys. Strange net. Alright, so, 737. You can see. It is taxiing. So, it's getting ready to take off. And I'll show you guys the visit.
one thing I'll tell you is up here on the wings, you see that little hole right below that red light? That is the overflow. If the chuffs don't work and starts overflowing, it starts spraying fuel out the uh, tail wings like that. And it pisses it out really quickly. So if you're going to fuel one, for whatever reason, avoid standing right in front of it. <laughs> or avoid standing in front of the tip of the tip tank, or the drop tank, whatever. So, yeah.